A group of static caravan owners in Northumberland say they're being forced to break lockdown rules after the site owner told them their holiday homes must be removed from the site by Saturday because they're being replaced by luxury cabins. But the caravan owners say that means they'll have to make journeys of hundreds of miles, potentially spreading COVID. Here's our news correspondent, Mark Denton. This is Chris's pride and joy. For the last few years, he's enjoyed holidays in his static caravan at Newton Hall Caravan Park near Annick. Started going in there, the air two fairs. Me, mum and dad uh, bought a static up there. You know, went there for many, many years. And as I've grown up and, you know, grown to love the area. But in late January, Chris, who's from Gateshead, received this letter from the owners of the site, the apartment group, who also own a number of bars in Newcastle. Soon he learned that 30 caravans, including his, would have to move from the site to make way for what the apartment group describes as luxury caravan cabins. Those asked to leave have been given until March the 13th to move their caravans and contents. At a time of continuing COVID travel restrictions, Chris says... That puts him in an impossible position. You know, if you look at the restrictions around COVID and they're asking people who put their, their health at risk, there's no concern for us as individuals or anyone on the site who's been asked to leave. Helen Pritchard's caravan will also have to move. Again, we're going up at the weekend to clear the full thing out and it's going to be a lot more people there. So basically there's going to be a mass amount of people there over the weekend, which really we're not allowed to do, you know, given our restrictions at the moment. And then there's Kirsten from Bradford, who'll need to make a six-hour round trip. I just feel like we have no alternative but to do it. Once we get up to the site, we're going to be mixing with other people from all over the country. And it kind of makes a mockery of the fact that we've stuck to the rules all this time and we're having no alternative but to, to break them. In a statement, the apartment groups say, as with so many businesses due to COVID-19, hospitality has been forced to close for the last 12 months, resulting in virtually no income for the business for almost a year. In order to protect as many jobs as possible, we've had to adapt and make adjustments to our business model. It was with a heavy heart that one of those decisions was not to renew the contracts of some caravans on the park. With regard to the lockdown issue, individuals are allowed to leave their home if they have a reasonable excuse which this is, and to fulfil a legal obligation, which this also is. Mark Denton, BBC Look North.